Hello, today, August 21st, 2017, I want to talk about the North American Solar Eclipse. Now, as you're probably aware, what happens with the solar eclipse is the moon will pass across the sun in its orbit, and will cast its shadow across the daylight side of the planet. Remember too, if you experience a full solar eclipse, to also look around you, because when you're in the shadow, the atmosphere is going to look weird and oddly dark, so take a look at the horizon, it's going to look really cool. Almost like a sunrise, but in a 360 degree panorama around you. This is going to be the last total solar eclipse until the year 2024 on April 8th, which will be passing across the east coast of America. But not only that, this solar eclipse is very interesting because it's going to be the most well documented solar eclipse in all of history. The majority of the population is always carrying a camera on them. Expect to see a lot of cell phone footage at insane resolutions like 4K. While you have your eyes in the skies, keep in mind that the ISS is going to have its eyes on the ground, and it's going to take some really cool photos of the umbra of the solar eclipse. Now the ISS is not going to pass under the shadow, unfortunately, but it will get a lot of cool photos. The ISS is going to transit three times and get some off-angle photos of the eclipse's shadow. So remember to be safe and wear proper glasses when watching the solar eclipse, or make yourself an eclipse projector, which I'll link a video in the description on how to make one. And keep in mind, if you're not in North America, there's an awesome software called Space Engine, which has recently released a patch to make the solar eclipse more accurate and cross the United States on this exact date. In fact, it's the software I'm using to make this video. Anyways, if you guys liked the video, please subscribe. Until next time, I'll see you in the next video.